Welcome back to Friday Night Football. It's now time for our Something's Gotta Give Bowl. The Grape Creek Eagles are on a nine-game losing streak dating back to last season. TLCA, a six-game losing streak. Those two teams met tonight at Lakeview Stadium for TLCA's homecoming. Eagles against Eagles. Both teams looking to notch a win. Grape Creek running that single wing offense. A jump pass. Landon Crow to Colin Humphrey. And that is going to get to the end zone. Excuse me. Spoke too soon. A foot race to the end zone is dragged down at the five. That leads to an easy score, however. Jorge Rodriguez cruises in for six. And now Grape Creek goes up six nothing. Early second quarter. Grape Creek looking to extend the lead. Lost in the scramble. Guess who comes up with it? Jacob Patterson for TLCA. Scoop and score to the house. And this ties the game up at six. TLCA missed the extra point. It was a turnover filled battle that Grape Creek would end up winning 42 to 14. Uh, to spoil TLCA's homecoming, we go out to Ryan Reynolds, who's at Lakeview Stadium, to talk to the winning head coach. That's right, Matt. Grape Creek picking up the win 42 to 12. Their first win since 2017. Joining me now is head coach for the Eagles, Grape Creek Eagles, because this was Battle of the Eagles. Tanner Teal, coach, like I said, first win since 2017. You guys get revenge from last year. Uh, you guys lost to TLC last year. You guys get revenge there. Some thoughts on the game. Um, you know, like we talked about earlier, it was a sloppy first half. We turned the ball over four times. We you know, made some corrections at halftime. We played a much better second half, got some things rolling, and, and was just really glad that we finished the game the way we did. 42 points on the board, like you said. It was a pretty sloppy first half. Turnover filled first half for, for both teams. What did you kind of tell them heading into the locker room for halftime? Well, I basically just told them to hold on to the ball that they're going to be standing on the sideline next to me. <laughs> and you guys running that new single wing offense. It's looked good through three weeks. You guys hold Stanton um, eight to zero against Stanton. You guys come back, give Cristobal a battle, and here you are in week three with the first win. Just how has the kids? How have the kids adapted to that single wing? And uh, how has it given you just a competitive advantage? They've uh, they definitely bought in. It's something new. It's something that nobody else runs around here. So, you know, each week we've gotten a little bit better. You know, we didn't score against Stanton, but we moved the ball okay. We scored a little bit more last week. And then this week, it just kind of started to click and, uh, you know, finally put some, some serious points on the board. You guys hosting Coleman next week. Grape Creek gets the win 42 to 12. We have more highlights from Friday Night Football. Back to you, Matt. This update sponsored by All-American Chevrolet of San Angelo.